Once again, all elders in Nigeria knows that man in Asso Rock is not Buhari, and it pained me to the marrow of my bone that Aisha Buhari, the wife of late General Muhammad Buhari, connived with the elders of the North and sinned against God and against Nigeria as a whole to deprive her husband, state defeated Beria, as the leader of Nigeria who died January 27, 2017 in London, United Kingdom, and was buried in foreign land, Saudi Arabia. What a great shame, Aisha Buhari. You brought to your family, especially your daughter and son, who graduated recently that they can never point to the grave of their father in the nation that their father served for many years. Your operation and your cooperation with Kabas will serve as a guilty conscience to you till you enter your grave. The looted money you saved in foreign land cannot save you from your calamity of lies that entangles you. John 8, 32-35 and you shall know the truth, and the truth shall make you free. They answered him, and Abraham's descendants and never been in bondage to anyone. How can you say you'll be made free? Jesus answered, Most assuredly, I say to you, whoever commits sin is a slave of sin, and a slave does not abide in the house forever, but son abides forever. If you repent, Lord is able to forgive you and confirm the truth to the whole nation. In Amdikano, I put leader was right about his findings in Asso Rock, Okorosha, Oshiomole, Galadima, Dajuma, Obasanjo, just few. They all know what we knew. Yoruba people should be aware that no more rule of law in Nigeria. Nigeria is disintegrated nations where all states should make the law that pleases them and protect their citizens now. If 12 states in northern Nigeria should adopt Sharia law without following the constitution, that means that Biafrans are not to us and Niger Delta to do what pleases their citizens and to protect their citizens. Nigeria, an abode for terrorists, bandits, husbands, remnants of ISIS, ISWA, and terrorism, should be on watch list of United Nations and United States of America and State of Israel constantly. Contrary to Femi Adeshino or presidency, that America should not interfere to Nigeria affairs, there is no more a country called Nigeria. We have disintegrated Nigeria. On behalf of Odudu and Republic, I'm imploring President Donald Trump 